feel like why did i even come here why did i even start youtube why did i even like you know but hey love and welcome back to my youtube channel welcome back to another vlog yes so i refuse to be sad i refuse to be depressed i refuse to be frustrated despite everything that's happening around me i refuse to be sad so guys today is just one of those days where i wake up and i'm just tired of like content creation i feel tired i feel frustrated because sometimes things just don't go the way i plan it to go i mean youtube is youtube is is really really hard it's really hard i'm not even going to lie for beginners like us for small youtubers like me youtube is really hard especially if you stay in this path of the world that i live in it's really really hard you know <laughs> nigeria is a place where we're not assured of constant you know electricity supply so you pick up a phone you want to film and um boom they took up they take the light and not just that immediately the light is going off like see guys there's this factory behind my house where they produce um plastic or i don't know is a warehouse or something yeah i think it's a warehouse immediately the light goes off and sometimes even when the light is on they are always on generator and my house is just behind that warehouse the noise is always massive and then some other person put on the their own generator and then the um the noise coming from the cars the children shouting god this is really really and then you see that at the end of the day i may not end up doing that video and that's why most of the times i don't do sit down and talk videos guys i have lots of lots and lots of stories to share with you guys g's you know stuff to just share with you guys but if i say i want to sit down and talk you mean the noise is always very 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 crazy which is why most times i've been doing worst and best review makeup artists lately you know i just go out to do content and most times even when i go out it's just a general thing in nigeria especially in this part of you know the city where i live everywhere is always noisy 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 i'm not even going to lie for the past few weeks i've just been mentally stressed if you notice guys i've not really been posting like that i i tried to i was trying to post three times a week but men I realized that I can't do it. Even the two times I'm trying to post, it's still, it's still very stressful for me because I don't have like a sitting, sit down and talk space to do videos. My environment is very noisy. Sometimes I don't even have money to get data. Man, guys, I just want to come on here and share with you guys. I rant. I don't know, but I'm not even going to talk about the struggles on how to get to YouTube threshold. One thousand subscribers, you guys. Don't worry, I'm going to do a video on that to share with you how I got to my one thousand subscribers, um, watch hours, got monetized, and all that. You guys, I'm not trying to discourage you all. If you're about to start YouTube, start just start. I believe that I've watched some of the content creators' videos from like way back, back, back. Some of them put their literally put their phones on like a like a. A book or something to film some of them they are they don't stay in luxury houses like they do now you know I feel like it's a gradual state these are the sacrifices you know we have to pay to get to that place we're going to and that's what keeps me going basically you know sometimes I feel like why did I ever come here why did I ever start YouTube why did I ever like you know but I just tell myself, oh, even if I say I want to start a business, I want to do a business, I want to work in an office, I will still have to put this much effort, I will still have to sacrifice, it's still going to be stressful. I mean, there's nothing that is easy. Success does not come, you know, at the platter of gold, you need to put in the work, which is why I just keep going. So, if you're looking at starting a YouTube channel, irrespective of your environment, irrespective of what you have, 
if you don't have the camera you don't have to wait until you have the camera irrespective of the noise the environment actually i'm trying to invest on getting a i have there's this um i don't know there's this microphone that actually cancels background noise in the you know your environment i don't know if that's going to work because i really need to invest on that and guys also please don't skip my art if you watch my videos it helps me you know at least i got monetized last month and i'm yet to be paid but then just please support your girl so basically that's it guys so um i'm just going to go ahead and cook my food and then tomorrow i will be going to the hospital i need to go see a doctor for like a checkup you know i have um there's this stuff that's going on with me so i need to see a doctor tomorrow and um just you know to figure out what is wrong with me actually so um guys i'll see you guys very soon the next day hey guys so this is me another day in the hospital i didn't show you guys when i was coming here because i was just tired i'm getting used to this vlogging thing so we're all here waiting outside so when you get to the hospital you know you're going to get registered and then we're going to be given a number and you're just going to sit down and wait just because of what corona has caused so you all can't just you know move inside the hospital like that so here we are sitting down outside and just waiting for your number to be called and i'm the number 37th person today to um i didn't really come early you know so i came around 9 a.m so a lot of people are already here before me so i decided to take a walk around to other sections i mean these are other people waiting as well to see a doctor but not you know my own section um i think these ones are waiting for you know like maybe a specialist to see like a specialist for something you know but i just decided to take a walk around yeah so um finally with the corridors and then we're going up to you know where we're going to see the doctor and <laughs> We got here again we still need to sit down you know observing our social distancing as well while waiting to be called two hours later hi guys so i just got home now i'm so so tired like the process the procedures and the, everything you have to take to see a doctor is stressful hey guys i got there around 9 a.m in the morning guess what the time is now this is past one like almost 1 30 pm i'm just getting back home i'm tired i'm hungry i'm stressed i should have gone to see the doctor since last week but i've been procrastinating because of these same reasons you will get there you pick a number after picking a number if you're not lucky you're going to be like the 50th person like and they'll call you guys in like five 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 people goes in and then after like one hour or more another five goes in so you can imagine how long it would take before if I, okay my number today was i was a 37th person so so stressful i just regret why i did not eat before leaving the house so eventually i was called and then we went up we they checked our blood pressure they confirmed that we paid for consultation fee and then we started waiting again you go up does not mean that it was it's now your turn no. then we'll start waiting again it was it was just two doctors that were on duty it's really stressful that was why i didn't go so this thing was like i had like a there's this stuff i had on my bikini line that was swollen i noticed it last week so it was really really painful but then the pain started reducing but i was still concerned like i had to know why what you know what really cost it so that was why i went there i checked it and they checked my blood pressure guys my blood pressure went high elevated i don't know i think i need to i need to start doing more of exercise i need to start eating well i've been mentally stressed for the past few weeks because i've just been stressed anxiety worry and everything i think that's the reason why my blood pressure increased so i'm just going to take time and i'm going to try and start exercising more anyways so i just said let me come on here and share with you guys what's up i i will i got like some plantain or ripe plantain on my way back here so i'm just going to make that 
and I'm um, just I have like some sauce in the fridge I'm just going to uh, defrost it and just use it to eat it like I'm so tired I, I don't even have strength to cook right now so I'm going to just go and try and make the food because <laughs> if I don't there's nobody to make it for me okay so let me just this is like is this like a brunch because it's past this is no more breakfast and uh, I don't know but I'll see you guys later let me make my food a few moments later Hey love, so this is later. me another day. I, I needed to, I think two days later, I was a bit stronger. I, you know, I already started taking my medication, so I was getting better. You know, but I was cashless and I need to go to the bank. And the funny thing is, I didn't have money in my Naira account, so I had to go, you know, so that I can withdraw some dollar bill, you know. Um, so I was you know usually everywhere this corona thing has just changed everything anyways i eventually withdrew the money and I, this is me on my way going to actually change the money in the market then once i'm done changing the money okay yeah this is the money i had 50 dollar bills that i needed to change you know to our own nigerian naira here so i eventually changed it it was about <laughs> It gave me 23,500 naira that was what it gave me you know so i don't know but yeah that's that's, that's the money i'm holding right there here yeah. so i eventually collected the money and i went over to get a paint not so far from the market around that place so this is me here in the paint shop i wanted to paint my house because the paint you know in my house is due so i actually went to get a paint shop then yeah from there i went to I went home, I dropped the paint, I didn't film that part. So this is me here trying to the next get day. breakfast to eat and <laughs> I was trying to dance here. So I was trying to make tea and then I was also toasting, you know, bread to just eat. This is I've just been eating a lot of bread. I don't know. Well anyways, I need some fats because I realized that I've lost a lot of weight. So I mean, let me get some. <laughs> let me get some carbohydrate you know anyway so this is me trying to make tea and then um, actually this is not my house i'm at my sister's place so i left my house yesterday to my sister's place today i'm sorry again that i didn't show you guys coming to this place you get i mean vlogging in lagos is you know people just look at you as if you're about you're committing a crime you know they just keep on looking and looking and it's it just makes i'm still trying to get used to it you get so guys i'm sorry i didn't carry you along okay hi right, um i'm at my sister's place i just came here to rest I've been stressed out. So I came here to rest and chill so that somebody will be asking me in the morning, what do you want to eat? What do you want to eat? What do you want to eat? But anyways, I'm living here today, shall I came yesterday, I couldn't vlog because my phone started acting up. My battery started dying like I don't know but my phone started acting up so I could not vlog even now. I still have to go and check what the problem is because I don't know what's wrong. So I'm toasting bread and I want to have it with tea.
Hey, little man. Come over here. Come. Come over. Come over. Yeah, walk it, baby. Walk it. Praise. 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 Oh my goodness. Come here. <laughs> so guys, my sister is cooking and I don't know what she's cooking. You would not allow your mommy to rest. I carry this, but this boy will be crying. He doesn't want any other person to carry him except his mother. Praise, praise. Praise, boo boo. Praise, boo boo. Praise, darling. Hey, guys. What's up? Um, sorry, I've not been carrying you all along with the vlog i'm not used to it i'm just trying to see if i can do you know vlog sometimes one or two times show you guys what i always do sometimes in my life okay aside from makeup and all those and all those other stuff so i left my sisters out yesterday and yeah from the way, from the first time i started the vlog i talked i ranted i talked about how youtube is frustrating and all that and then i went to my sister's place but Okay, they went to the hospital, but I'm getting better. I'm taking my drugs. Yeah, I think I'm going to end this vlog here because I really don't want it to get too long. I think I'm getting really dark. I'm, I'm trying a new product, so I think like it's making me dark. Kind of. Oh. Anyways, I'll be fine. <clears throat> so, guys, let me know if you want to see more of this kind of vlog from me. Definitely subscribe to my channel, please, and don't forget to on the bell notification that pops up after you subscribe. And let me know down below what you think about this vlog. What's your favorite part? Don't call me a foodie, please, please, please. <laughs> all right, guys, I'll see you all in my next video.